Hi guys, this is my all-in-one compact and I'm going to be doing all of my face with just this one compact. I've got my powders in the bottom, creams on the top, and I'm going to use just this one brush. The first color I'm dipping into here is my main highlight color. It's akin to uh, your typical foundation. It's the same color as my skin tone. And I'm just, right now, I'm just putting some little dots all over my face. We call this like a cheetah hack. And I'm just placing it in all the areas I want. This color I'm putting underneath my eyes is my brightening highlight. It's a bit lighter than my regular skin tone. And I'm just putting it in places that I want to pop. And I'm also using it as a concealer for that under eye. Um, as you can see, I've got the two-sided brush. So I just flip back and forth when I'm applying it and buffing it out. This is my henna contour. I am just going down my cheekbones and all of the regular places that I do my contour. Um, it, I, my skin is getting a little bit darker, so I might play with a different contour. Just going along my jawline, put some on my forehead, and again, I'm still using the small end of that brush and just applying it in all the places that I want my contour. I'm contouring the nose and my jawline, my forehead. Now I took the other side of the brush, just the fluffier side of the brush, and I'm blending out the the main highlight color that I put around my mustache area and now I'm going under the under eye. The great thing about these brushes is that the color will not transfer to the other places because it picks up very little product and it just blends in like a dream. So I'm just going to blend out those colors and as you'll notice I am actually in my vehicle. We are in Montana traveling so I just wanted to show how easy this makeup is in a vehicle even if you don't put it in the exact right places or you're bumping around. It's so forgiving and it blends out so well that you will look like you did it at home. This whole process took me about uh, just about 11 minutes and I had to wait at certain times to wait for the lighting to change because I had direct sunlight on my face and it was... It was not working. <laughs> All right, I'm putting bronzer on right here. This right now, this is the Bella bronzer that I love. If you've seen any of my other videos, you'll know how much I love Bella bronzer. It's a matte finish bronzer. I'm just taking some of that down my neck to blend in with my face, and you'll notice I am just fluffing and and swirling. Um, now I'm applying some uh, lip and cheek to my cheeks. Just give it a blush there, and I'm using the fluffy end of the brush again. This is also the color. This is sandstone. It's a sandstone lip and cheek, and I just barely got it. I'm loving it. Putting a little contour under my lip, blending it out. Okay, so for the eyeshadow, I want to I wanted to use the same brush again to so, show how easy it is. This is actually a Bella bronzer that I'm putting on my that I put on my face and putting on my eyes as well. And I'm using that same foundation brush, just the smaller smaller end. I do have another video on how I use Bella bronzer as my eyeshadow and I mix it with a little illuminator and I'm using this same concept here. If you want to see a little bit more detail on that, go check that video out. I did put a little summer love on my lips, now some mascara, a couple coats, and yeah, I hope you saw my daughter in the background smiling and looking bored. Hopefully she's a little better, but thanks for watching guys. If you like this video, please subscribe and like it. Thank you.